Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today on a video that I will be finally retwisting my dreads and showing you how I do it. This is a video I have been asked to make several times before. Thing is, I don't like retwisting my dreadlocks. That's why I've taken so long to make this video. Let me give you a brief background on my dreads. I got my dreadlocks three years ago. They are three years old, turning four in April 2019. They are not freeform, Contrary to their appearance, when I got them, I had relaxed hair. So my plan was to go cutting the ends as my natural hair grows because I was not about to do that big chop. So now my dreads are fully natural. There's no more relaxed hair on here. And the reason why they look freeform is that they, I'd say they kinda are because a month after I got them, they got rained on and I was not about to go to the salon and spend another a thousand bob just to get Get them redone so what i did or what my boyfriend did was retwisting my whole head himself and he's actually one of the reasons why they look so good because if he hadn't helped me with that early on dreadlock care i'd have been so lost there's not enough resources on youtube for four month old dreadlocks or rather at the time there wasn't so there was just so much confusion and because neither of us were experts the dreads didn't end up looking the same size so a lot of dreadlocks on my head are very uneven there are some which are very thick others are slightly thick while others are very thin earlier i said that i hate retwisting my dreads my last salon visit was in october 2017 while my last retwist was probably six or five months ago i usually use coconut oil and i find it mildly effective that's because a lot of the dreads didn't hold when i used coconut oil last time today i'm about to use aloe vera gel and how i found out that aloe vera gel is suitable for dreadlocks is through sheath naturals you'll see just how tightly they hold although i'll just know a few days later i'll update you guys on my instagram make sure your hair is more moisturized keep on spritzing water on it throughout the retwisting process you'll see me do that one important thing i forgot to mention is you will need these i usually use like about a hundred of them so i had to buy a new stash because i have like seven only and those are not enough this will help me hold the newly twisted dreads in place so definitely start by adding more water I'm just going to be dipping into my aloe vera gel throughout the process so if you just see something wet on my fingers that's it so take just a little aloe vera and apply on the growth and then just put your comb in there twist it can get so difficult because at a point it kind of jumps into your hair and then when you're satisfied with twisting find a way yeah pull it out and you can just go in with your fingers from that point. So you see this situation here refused to detangle. So it's just up to me to let it be. It's been so long since I did this. I'm actually forgetting how to use that comb. I've given up using the comb. It's too difficult. Let's see if my fingers are good enough. take it round and round for me i like to go to the point i feel that it's tight and then i let it sit i'm kind of getting worried about all the whiteness that's happening on my dreads but the good thing with aloe vera gel is that it promises that it won't leave you with any build up i think i finally have the hang of it so spritz your water go in with aloe vera gel and I'm being so generous with my scoops. And then go round and round. Take it for a spin. And then once you feel like it's tight enough, not too tight, don't hurt yourself. Spin this rest of the part. So this is where the safety pins come into use. You're going to need them to like hold the dreads that you have just freshly retouched because you're not an expert or you probably are. I'm not an expert and I like them to hold in place like that Mr. Kareke Mani Toda nireta chuma Ogyo kera wakwa kiumia 
Nilikana wogete doke hutia E woka gawa kwa teire Okiuga dena kasheshe Ate niede babina Dena dredina Dogone mugutia E une nie oinaga Tigye damo denyo zire Itakwele tene da kweta Digue na mudeño dire o tamen ya te dije gotiga Canabe hoy no que o toje Guys, look at this mess These are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 Six dreadlocks in one Hario ni te te baby do karakie Hario ni te te baby do karakie Shot and sweet, they were out of where we were down. We were no god was speedy. How on you the damn baby don't cut a kid? How on you the damn baby don't cut a kid? Finally finished, and oh my god, I am so tired. The hair is all laid in pins right now, and it will stay that way till bedtime, I guess. So I'll just need to go in the sun right now and let it dry because it is incredibly wet and dreadlocks aren't meant to stay wet for so long you can already see how fresh and new they look and none of them is a hundred percent perfect but it's okay you just don't need to beat yourself up i beat myself up so much when i'm doing them so i guess that's it if you like to see more dreadlock videos i really want to share with you guys but give me a thumbs up because that's the only way that i know you like these videos i'll see you in my next video Bye for now.